during my four years in China, Shifu Hu Jiansheng was the master that I was looking for, you know, guiding me in all aspects of my training as well as helping me to try and achieve my goals, introducing me to the abbot uh, Shu Yongxin as one of his best students. I feel uh, very honoured to, to have a man like Shifu Hu Jiansheng as, as my master. Uh, Shifu Hu Jiansheng has been trained in Shaolin martial arts, traditional Shaolin martial arts, for more than uh, 25 years, coming up to 30 years. Uh, he's had his school for, for just about 10 years now. And uh, when I first met him uh, back in 2005, you know, he was a very humble man. You know, he, he offered me a lot of training that other people weren't offering me. You know, traditional training, which is kind of uh, unheard of now in China. A lot of it is the performance side of things. But, you know, he offered me this insight. He had scriptures of, of Shaolin scrolls, which are more than five, six hundred years old, you know, talking about... Uh, detailed things about Xin Yu Ba, you know, about your breathing, about your temples, about the eyes, you know, how, how the form should be done. And he opened that up to me, and not only did he open it up, it wasn't a cost, you know, he never asked for any money from me, he just wanted to help me, and I would help him in return with what I could help him with. And and I think that we just had a balanced, a balanced relationship, and during the time in China, you know, he did his best to to help me and guide me as his, his student and as his disciple. His students are very, very disciplined, you know, the, one of the only lot of students who are still studying traditional Kung Fu and uh, very respected by the abbot, you know, in the, in the Shaolin performance team at the temple are the traditional guys are coming from Hu Jinchen school and, uh, you know, they're very good, the abbot likes them a lot and you can see over the four years that I was with him you could just see more and more students coming in and more and more discipline coming out of the school and the school just getting bigger and bigger and bigger.